Hi, this is Bird from Birds SVGs, and in this video, we will be putting together the letter to and from Santa, and that's from the Countdown to Christmas SVG collection. So, first of all, we'll do our letter to Santa. So, you'll need to, when you lift this large white piece from your cutting mat, you'll also need to save the moustache piece. It, it might be um, easy to actually discard that uh, without realising, but you will need to keep that piece. Um, so I've decided to um, glue mine down directly to my red piece of card, my backing layer. But I think it would also look nice if you pop the moustache up on some 3D adhesive, but obviously that's your choice how far you want to go with any dimension or embellishments. So I'm just adding some glue to all of the detail areas. If you don't have a precision tip, just add a few dots here and there and that'll be enough to hold it into place. So I'm just trying to centralise this onto my red layer, trying to keep my border similar all the way around. And then I'll glue my moustache into place. So on this letter, it says, Dear Santa, and there's an area there for your child to write their wish list to Santa and their declaration of how good they've been all year. Um, and then with the envelope, that's already addressed because we know that it's going to Santa and we know where Santa lives and we've got a nice festive postage stamp detail on it too. So you want to fold along all of these four um, sides on your envelope and just add some glue to the bottom edge of the sides and that's your envelope done and then you want an insert. I wanted white um, to appear through all of the detail in my envelope so I chose some single sided pattern paper that way I get the white to go through the cutouts and then I get some uh, colourful paper on the inside of my envelope. So I'm just centralising it and then all I need to do is add some glue along that top edge and that's my envelope done. If you'd like a plain envelope without any cutout detail if you're uh, sending it through the post for instance um, then you do have plain envelopes um, all of the envelopes in the collection have a plain version in your download okay so that's our letter to Santa completed and we'll move on to our letter from Santa So again, you've got your large white piece and you'll need to make sure that you keep the moustache piece and don't discard it by accident. And again, I am adding some glue directly onto the back of this piece to directly glue it onto my red layer. So this letter says from Santa. Um, so if you know Santa, he might help you fill it out. Otherwise, you could do him a favour and fill this letter out for him. So you'll need to address it to your child along with um, any message. So you want to pop that into place, making sure it's central on that red piece. And then again, pop some glue onto the back of the moustache. And then pop that into place with an even border around the edge of it. And then moving on to our envelope, we've got the same festive postage stamp on the front of our envelope from Santa. Um, so you'll, you'll need to fill in the name of your child on the front, um, but on the back it actually says from Santa. So again, to put it together, we'll fold along all of the four sides and then add some glue along the bottom of the sides but then because we've got the from Santa lettering on the flap of our envelope when we pop our insert in we'll add some extra glue there so we'll fold our insert with the pattern side on the inside of the fold we'll just slide it in make sure it's central and then we're going to add some glue to the top edge of our insert 
and around this writing. Now, although I added some spots of glue to the inside the letters that I thought might have a chance of lifting, a couple of the pieces actually did. So in a moment, I'm going to show you how you can solve that if you've got um, something uh, very thin, like a spatula that you might use for taking your pieces off your cutting mat. Because those are particularly thin. Um, if you try and bend something up with your fingernail, you'll often crease it. But this doesn't do that at all. So there you can see I'm just literally sliding it under. And it just adds enough glue that you can then press down and it, it just solves your problem. That is my method for all um, pieces that might lift on me. Okay, and there you have it. There's your letter to and from Santa. I hope they add some excitement in the whole build up to Christmas for you and your family.